Hey guys, what's up? Okay, so I'm here to do a, a quick little update for you. So, I've been going through a lot. Um, I'm actually getting divorced. Um, I know, I've only been married since May and I'm already getting divorced, but, um, you know, I just can't allow myself to be with somebody who put, thinks it's okay to put their hands on me. Um, one thing you guys don't know is I actually had him arrested when we were in California and he spent five days in jail for it. Um, he is not only physically abusive but also verbally and you know a lot of people are like oh well can't you work things out this and that. Well it's not like it's only happened once or twice. So no I'm past trying to work things out. I'm over it. Like, even when things are good, I feel like I'm walking on eggshells around him because he just has a shitty attitude in general, and I'm just, I'm done with it. Um, we've been separated for almost a month now, and I'm living with a roommate. I have my own bedroom, and it's just, I, I already feel so much less stressed out. Like, I feel a lot more relaxed. I'm not always, like, <sighs> hmm. I always felt kind of down, even though I didn't want to. I really had no reason to. It's just, yeah. What finally caused the big argument is we've been back in Maryland for two months, and he hadn't applied for a job anywhere. And I had tried talking to him calmly about it one week, and, you know, he acted like he understood, and he was going to, you know, start applying, and, well, here it is a week later, and he hadn't even done one application, so he started getting, so I tried to talk calmly to him, and he started getting shitty with me, so I got shitty with him back, and finally I was just like, get off your butt and get a job, in a, a much more explicit way, of course. But, um, he responded and he was like, well, I'm done. And I'm like, you know what, fine. You say you're done every time we get in an argument. This is the fourth time since we've been back. He said it too. Do the math, that's every other week. See ya, I'm out of here. And, uh, packed all my crap and left. But, yeah, so that's what's going on with me right now. Aren't you jealous? Not really. I'm sure some of the haters are going to be like, ha 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 ha, but, ha ha, I don't care. <laughs> Um, so, last week, my friend Sarah and I, who are both going through some rough times right now, she was like, let's go get something pierced, and I was like, I don't really have the money for that, I'm trying to pay for a lawyer right now, and she's like, well, I'll pay for you, but I get to pick what you get pierced, so she actually picked for me to get my bottom lip, I really like it, she originally picked my eyebrow, but I was like, no way, <laughs> I don't want my eyebrow done, so the second pick was my lip, and um, she had me pick hers, and I picked for her to get her rook done, because the next day she had an interview for an office job, so she couldn't get like a facial piercing. Um, so state board is Tuesday, so wish me luck. Um, really looking forward to it, hoping to pass. Um, I have some videos coming up. I have a review for a company in Australia called Going Dancing. They sent me some body jewelry, so expect a review on that as soon as possible because I feel like a slacker at the moment. Um, so yeah. And then I'll do a room tour once I get, you know, everything really finished in my room. And that's about it. Talk to you guys later. Bye.